All right, let's find the domain of f of x equals x squared minus 6x plus 7 over x squared minus 16. Now, since this is a rational function, we need to worry about vertical asymptotes. And in this case, vertical asymptotes are going to be when the denominator is equal to 0, or in every case for a rational function. So if we set x squared minus 16 equal to 0, that tells us that x squared is equal to 16. And we take the square root of both sides to get x is equal to positive or negative 4. Now that means that if those two values, there's going to be a vertical asymptote. So when we write our domain and interval notation, we need to account for those. So we're going to start off at negative infinity. And of course, that needs a parenthesis, not a bracket. And it's going to go to negative 4, again, with a parenthesis, because it's never going to get there. Then in union with negative 4 to 4, both of those in parentheses, because it doesn't get there, because they will be undefined. And then in union with 4 to infinity. So this is going to be our final domain in interval notation.